Welcome back to Voters, Brother Brown here, bringing you a brand new showcase featuring Brother Wojtek in his debut match using his Bloom Lord Hydramon deck against Brother Juan with his Jessmon deck. So it looks like Brother Wojtek is going to win the dice roll and go first. Digivolves in the back. Then Digivolves to the Red Vegemon for one to pass turn over to Brother Juan. Brother Juan Digivolves to Solarmon in the back. Then just builds up into the Biohuck for two, passing over to Brother Wojtek for one. Gonna move up the Red Veggie and just play a Mimi for four to pass turn. So Juan's gonna move up. Then Digivolve into the Savior Huck, which because it's one Digivolving effect, he's gonna be able to swing over that unsuspended Red Veggie and draw because of the Gummymon Inheritable. Gonna play the Huckmon for three to look at the top five. Gonna get himself another Huckmon, as well as that Sistermon seal to his hand. But the Vortech Digivolves the Plumlon in the back. Tries to activate the Mimi, but unfortunately he can't because he does not control level 5. So he's gonna play the Palamon. Looking at the top four, get himself a, either a plant or vegetation or fairy. Decides to get the Sunflormon. And he's just gonna go ahead and Digivolve into that for two to pass turn back to Brother Wan. Brother Wan's going to Digivolve to that Huckmon in the back. Go for security the other one. It's going to die in security. Then he plays the From Master to Disciple to look at the top three. Going to grab himself the Sistermon block to his hand. The rest is going to go to the trash. Digivolves into the Blitz Jessmon. Just going to swing for two checks, but it will also allow him to play a Sistermon from his hand. He gets Sistermon Seal, which is going to give him an extra memory as well as an extra 2k DP. So two checks, as well as the Savior Huck's going to activate, allowing him to play out another Sistermon. He's going to play out the other Sistermon Seal, the Structure Deck one. And he's going to get himself the Bio Huck to his hand, the rest is going to trash, as well as give him Reboot. So Brother Voitech Digivolves to the Atchisermon for three. Going to activate the effect to allow him to play a Plant or Vegetation for free from his hand. Decides to play the Red Veggie. Now he can use the Mimi because he controls that Agitar Mon, moving up the Paluma Mon. And then Digivolves into Bloom Lord to pass turn. We'll give him a memory because he suspends that. Wan's gonna swing. We'll be able to beat over it because of the extra DP. Attacks the Huckmon, suspends the other Sismon, but it's not gonna matter. Starting up game two, Brother Vortex is gonna start. Evolve the Palamon in the back, and then play a Green Memory Boost for three, looking at the top four. Gonna grab himself an Agitarmon, passing over to Brother Juan at three. Now he's gonna Digivolve to the Huckmon in the back. And then Digivolve to the Bio Huck for two. And then Juan's gonna play a Memory Boost of his own, looking at the top four for a Red Digimon this time. Gonna get himself a Huckmon, bringing it over to Brother Voitech. Move out that Palamon. Digivolve on the Sunfloor for two, allowing him to play that Palamon for free. Gets himself the Bloom Lord because it's a fairy, as well as the Hydramon. He does swing with the Palamon. Fortunately, he can't do that because he just played it, but these things happen sometimes. So he's just gonna play a Mushroom for two to pass turn. Brother Wan's gonna move up. Pop that red memory boost for two memory. And then you evolve to save your huck for three. This is going to the Blitz Jessmon. It's gonna allow him to swing for two checks. Play a system on block this time. That's gonna let him trash a card in his hand to draw two. Then thanks to the inheritable to save your huck, he's gonna be able to play one more. It's gonna allow him to cycle a little bit more, trash another card to draw two. And now because of the bio hucks effects, he's gonna be able to pop that sun floor on and the Huckmon's effect is going to let him look at the top five and get all the Sistermons that he reveals. So 2x Hidden Potential is going to go to his hand, and it's going to pass back to Voitech. Voitech hatches. Digivolves to the Sunfloor for two, activating the effect to play the Weedmon for free. Decides to pop the Green Memory Boost to play another one. And grab the Pulmon from that. 
the Digivolve that same Pulumon for a draw in the back. Then play the option card Grand Del Sol, which is going to allow him to suspend one and get to bottom deck a suspended Digimon, which is really nice because it gets rid of that Justmon and gets through the decoy effect of the Sistermon block. Very nice play by Brother Voitech. Digivolves the Solarmon in the back for a draw. And we go into a Biohawk for two. Then we continue the build by Digivolving to the Savior Huck for three. Digivolving into the Jessmon X Antibody. Getting a full stack in the back. He's going to swing the Sistermon. And then he's going to swing the other one. Unfortunately, it's going to hit a Mimi. So now he can't Memory Choke him, which is very unfortunate for Brother Wan. So he's going to pass turn by playing a Huckmon. Going to get himself that Sistermon block. As well as that Structure Drac Jessmon to pass turn. Voitech's going to move up here. I'm going to try to use the meaning again, because he doesn't have that level 5, he won't be able to use it. He's going to swing for Security of Weedmon, is going to get taken down. Digivolve the Agitramon for 3. Use the Agitramon's effect to suspend to play a Weedmon, which Palumon is going to trigger allow him to suspend that other Huckmon. Gonna swing over that uh, Sistermon's block. Pop for the green memory boost playing the Bloom Lord. He's gonna give himself two memory as well as to unsuspend. By suspending the Weedmon. So the Weedmon should be suspended here. He's gonna play the Hidden Potential to play out the Agitar. He can't play that because he doesn't have another target to suspend. It doesn't matter in the grand scene of things. Swing for two checks as well as get Piercing. And he Digivolves to the Red Vegemon for one past turn. So you digivolve into the Jessmon GX, which is going to allow him to play a Royal Knight into its evolution sources. He's going to go into the Genku X, which he's going to gain the effect to keep him from getting returned back to the hand or deck or have his DP reduced, and play a Sistermon block for free to gain himself a draw, as well as it's going to have Blocker. And because of these the Savior Huckmon, he will be able to restand because he played a Sistermon. So he's going to go a swing. It has piercing, so the Agitar is also going to go down. And Justmon GX does have blocker as well, so Brother Voitech does have to take care of two blockers. And he has the perfect act with Sumdi Sumdi, which is going to suspend both of them because of the Palumon. So now all he has to do is swing twice for game. Starting off game three, Brother Wan's gonna start by playing a Master and Disciple for two to get himself a. Then grab himself a Savior Huckmon to pass turn over to Brother Voitech for two. Brother Voitech's gonna respond by just playing a Mimi for four to pass turn. Brother Wan's gonna play this Sister One block to trash card in his hand to get himself two draws, passing over the turn to Brother Voitech. Brother Voitech's gonna play that Green Memory Boost. Getting himself the Palamon. Get Digivolve the Mushroom on the back for two. And then play another Green Memory Boost. This time he's going to grab that Red Veggie, passing over the turn to Brother One. Brother One's going to Digivolve the Solomon in the back. Swing and security is going to get uh, taken out, and he's going to digivolve into the Biohuck. Then finish it off by digivolving the Savior Huck for three. But the Voidless is going to move that Mushroom on, play the Palamon, grab himself, grab himself, I believe that was the Sunflorm on. Digivolve Red Vegemon for one, and that's going to pass back over to Brother Wan. Brother Wan's going to move up. I'm going to go for that Blitz Jessmon. He's going to go for that Blitz. Get himself a Sistermon. 
Gonna go for Sysmon Seal, giving him a memory and extra 2k. Gonna unsuspend thanks to the Savior Huck. Bio Huck's gonna pop. He's gonna choose the red Vegemon, and he's gonna get a draw thanks to the baby. The Vortex starts. Digivolt the Pulling One in the back. Goes for the Sunflowmon, using the effect to play out a free Weedmon. Gonna pop the Green Memories to go into the Agitarmon. Agitarmon's gonna use the effect to play out another Sunflowmon for free. Gonna use the Mimi to move up the Palumon. I'm gonna Digizorp to go into the Blossomon for free. You see him finish off by Digivolving into a Hydromon, being able to suspend the Jessmon and bottom deck it at the end of turn thanks to its effect. Let's get a Digivolve into the Huffmon in the back. I'm gonna swing into the Pomo first, then drop the Death X. Which is gonna de Digivolve everything, and everything that's level 4 lore is gonna get deleted, leaving him just the Blossom on. Really rough play. So we're gonna Digivolve the Palumon in the back. And then turn it will delete everything with the lowest play cost. It's so gonna Digivolve into the Veggie and be able to move up because of the Mini. Digivolve into the Agitar for 3. Activate effects, suspend the Blossomon, play a free vegetation. He goes for the Weedmon. Then he's gonna Digizorp into the Blossomon for free. Pop that green memory boost, the perfect answer to the Death X, the Hydromon. It's gonna be able to suspend it, and at the end of the turn, it's gonna go to the bottom deck. Because he has the Hydromon, he will be able to gain all that memory back because of all the suspended Digimon on board. Gonna go into the Bloom Lord, which is gonna be able to suspend for four but he's going to gain a memory for each of his suspended Digimon, as well as the Agitars and Haribo, getting him another one, bringing it all the way back to zero his turn. Because it has Piercing, it will be able to check two checks. So he's going to pass turn by hard playing a Mushroom Mod for two. Hydromon's going to trigger, putting that to the bottom of the deck at the end turn. What a turn, what a play. Brother Voitech is looking very good in this position. So Brother One's going to move the Huckmon. Digimon into the Bio Huck. Going to Digivolt for three of the Savior Huck, but at this point, it's not going to matter because Brother Voitech can just swing here with the four Digimon he has, and that's going to be game. Thanks everyone for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, spread the good word by sharing the video, and most importantly, become a devotee by subscribing. Until next time, thanks for watching.